Okay, this girl's about to get, thank you. About to get my piercing for my head on back. Belly button, belly button. Why does it seem so close? Uh, regular, I know So, we'll clean up your navel, Make we'll sure mark it. I do want you to be standing up while we mark it, but then for the actual piercing okay. you can lay back. Some people say that, um, I've read that sometimes the piercing will reject, or sometimes, you know, if you're too fat, you may not be able to get it, you know, you just, I don't think I'm fat, but you know. <laughs> mm, it tends to be you just kind of have to get the depth right. All 100 no. pounds of you is that. Girl, you have to keep that. Okay, okay, okay. Don't fuck your freaking yell whatever you do. Don't yell. I don't yell. I don't even yell when needles go in me. So it's the same difference. Look at her face. Is that perfection? Really, bitch? <laughs> Watch your mouth, that's not ladylike. Look, look. Girl, you better focus on that damn camera. Girl, you better shut up before I make this camera go right up your nose. <laughs> Aren't you gonna stand up, folks? Uh, and if you can kind of roll your shirt up with your armpits so your arms can hang down, just okay. want your body to be positioned as evenly as possible. Uh, I know, huh? If you can kind of like. <laughs> Look how bad you is. Oh, oh. oh, come on. Sorry. Oh, they numb at first. No. Oh, no. They're Did marking you? it. Oh, marking it. Girl, they do that with, they don't do the timing with that. Because, you know, marker doesn't go to your belly. So there's a standing room over there. I got to get a very confirmed. Yeah. Is that where it's supposed to go? Because when they when they do it, oh, they're gonna clip okay. it like that, so it's gonna go in. Yeah. Come see. Okay, let me take my jacket. Uh, I mean, I might need a hand to hold, so now you might have to come over here. It's not gonna hurt, right? It'll be quick. <laughs> not as much as three times sticking your uh, arm with oh, an IV. Oh, I have cancer, so I'm sure this is the... She's a leukemia survivor. Yeah. Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Still kicking it? All right, yes. I'm gonna count to three. I want you to take a deep breath in on two, and let it out on three. One, two, and three. Mm. You okay? You sure you want to do this? Yep. Yeah. Well, it's too late for you. Does it I'm hurt? asking this. It doesn't hurt that bad as you think it is. It really doesn't. And do you guys get the supplies, like the cleaning supplies for it? Yeah. Okay. Any solutions if you want to look at them? That's how you clean it. Yes. Well, yeah, I know. Alcohol. Nope. No? No rubbing alcohol. Oh, really? It's, it's no. too strong. It'll yeah. kill the cells oh, we're trying I to get see. to grow in there. I see. Okay, you don't have to rush it, but as soon as you're ready, you can get up and take a look. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> my belly. Nikki. <gasps> Got it, guys. And she wasn't even a wuss about it. I thought she was going to like, ah! No, I'm not wussy at all. You like it? Yes. Cool. Okay. So, you're going to want to wash your hands before you yes. clean it. Don't handle the piercing with unwashed hands. While it's healing, don't let anyone else touch it at all. Right. You want to clean both sides of the jewelry, okay. leaving the jewelry in yeah. two to three times a day with a Q-tip and a saline solution. Saline. I do sell a premixed what about salt saline. Water? You can mix it up with the non iodized okay. sea salt and water. Okay. Um, the ratio is on the aftercare book that I'll send you with. Okay. And you don't want to use any rubbing alcohol, hydrogen yeah. peroxide, yeah. contact it solution that can kill the cells you're trying to get grow in that channel. Yeah, you keep it from finishing healing. So I learned something new yeah. today. Too. There you go. Yep. If you get concerned about an infection. 
action, start doing the saline yeah. soak where you mix up a cup, submerge it, lay yeah. back, <laughs> yep. let the entire thing soak five minutes twice a day. But that's mainly for a diamond touch. Okay. Otherwise, as long as you keep right. real clean, you should be fine. You don't want to change out the jewelry or remove the jewelry until you're fully healed. Yeah. Usually, you'd be looking about it nine took a, months. Uh, the nine one months. That, yeah. 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 The one that um, wow. the one YouTuber I watch, she has all uh -huh. kinds of piercings. She got yeah. her belly button pierced. Yeah. And she said that she couldn't take it out for a year before yeah. changing. Oh. Yeah. You pretty much, you got to go off of no tenderness and no crusties yeah. on the outside. Yeah. That's There's going to be crusties, just so you know. Right. Like, there's a difference between if it's like. Greenish yellow, I think it's. Yeah, infected. that's a bad sign. Yeah. But just like the but little dry it, skin yeah, flaking. Dry skin, like white stuff, yeah. you know, that's normal. Yeah. And then. Kind of the, looked it up on YouTube. Okay, yeah. well, let him know. explain to you. Be quiet so he can explain. And then if you want to keep the piercing open, gotta leave jewelry in it at all times. Okay. Yep. Alright. Cool. Alright, any questions? Alright, I'm just gonna put the right. tools up. Let me chip from here. And right. when I get my ID, I'll come down and I have one more person coming to see you. Well, so, so that's my piercing, guys. I got my belly button pierced, and I will see you guys later. Um, I love you guys, and like and subscribe. Okay, I'm next. Bye, guys. That's it. Bye.